the value of the show. And so as you guys are here, I want to say, for those of you who have, for some reason, gotten in your heads to, to turn your eyes away from YouTube, and gone shopping for Bill Nye Science Guy DVDs, <laughs> They're 40 freaking bucks a disc. Because the man, which is Walt Disney Corporation, <laughs> also wanted to only sell them in schools. But let me tell you here today, right now, to tell you that the man is now a woman. <laughs> and this woman, Lisa Clemens, sees it, I think, in a whole new way. And I'm very, very hopeful that by the holidays, by the big selling season in August, the discs will be what you would expect, 10 bucks or 12 bucks or something. Yeah. Yeah. What I want to do, I want to sell them on the notion of going back and revisiting, let's say, the dinosaur show. Yeah. Yeah. There's more stuff in there. Let's make it so Pluto gets a, its real current title. <laughs> um, uh, the invention, inventing episode was big fun, where we peeled a banana, maybe we will, maybe we'll come up with a nanotube, a banana tube. <laughs> so, uh, I am hopeful that we will, in a sense, bring the show back. Also, this Lisa Clements, who's very cool, uh, I believe will support one of my fantastic ideas. <laughs> As you may know, there's a crisis in algebra. How many people are not fans of algebra? Oh, my heart breaks for you. <laughs> algebra is so elegant and beautiful. I hope to produce a series of very short videos which we're going to call Solving for X. And then be in the science guy fashion. We, if train A is coming from Irvine at 38 kilometers, and train B is coming from Anaheim, and who gets there first? We will do all those. Uh, and you can download them and watch them over and over on your happy little uh, handheld thing. So I'm doing my best. I'm doing my best. Mike, man, take it.